Hello everybody, it's Guinea Sausage, and today I've got something very exciting to show you. It is nothing other than my very first Pokemon Center UK purchase. I can't believe it's finally here. I say finally, I ordered it like, well today's date is the 8th of January, 8th of January. I ordered this maybe the 1st of January. Um, so it didn't take too long. But long enough that it made me want it to turn up quicker, if you know what I mean. But I've got some really exciting bits in here. Shall I show you what we got? Shall I show you what we've got to open? I think I should, shouldn't I? I think I should. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to just rearrange the position of the camera. And we're going to open this together because I'm not even sure what's going to be in here. Mainly because I forgot what I ordered and I didn't want to check the emails because it's more of a surprise that way. And my memory is god awful. So let's do that, shall we? Let's rip into it! Well, this is a brand new and exciting angle, isn't it? I've not done this one before. Hello. Um, right, I don't know what to do. Shall I just crack into it? I mean, oh, actually, one of the things I wanted to say, if you do get anything from the Pokemon Center UK, I'm not sure if this counts for the US or Japan, I don't know. But, strangely enough, they've given me a package that is actually the Pokemon TCG... Uh, it's, it's the Pokemon boxes that they send to stores. So you'll see this in your Asdas, you'll see this in your game stores. Usually this is either full of booster boxes or full of ETBs. This one in particular is for the ETB and it says Pokemon or PC.com exclusive. So they, you, they've given me a really big box for something that shouldn't be too big. I don't know, I can't remember. I know what one of the things is in here, but I can't remember what else. And also what I'm looking forward to seeing is, is there a promo? Do we get the delivery, special delivery Charizard? Do we get Pikachu? Do we get anything? Or do we just not because it's so soon after it, uh, the Pokemon Center UK opened? Um, so it opened, what was it, like middle of December, I think it was? And I was really surprised that there was still stock. I was honestly expecting it just to have nothing. Um, just knowing what the climate's been like recently. Oh, okay, I know what we've got in here. <gasps> oh, can you see the goodies? Right, we'll start with these. I have managed to get, oh look at that, it's already flopped, it's all flopped, it's all fallen out the side. Oh, there's an Entei coin on it, so this is new. Uh, so I got, how many did I get? One, two, oh, three, and they're all Umbreon, which is nice, because I need that to even out my promo. So I got three of the triple blister packs, because everyone knows these are broken in a good way. Uh, <laughs> I like how only one of them actually has the, uh, that, that is in correct order. The others have got the, the cards flying up, or the packs flying outside. Two Derulodons in here. Everyone knows how I feel about Derulodon. I love him, just for the pull rate. So that's an exciting one. Well, oh, do I see a swell? I see a swell. We'll check these, the promos out in a little bit, but we got three of these. Uh, and what else? Did we get a promo? Doesn't look like we did, everyone. But what did I get? I'm actually quite surprised this is the same size, but we got a Pokemon Center exclusive elite trainer box for evolving skies which i will be cracking open at 100 subs so until then it's going to look and sit pretty on my shelves instead what we're going to do is open the triple blisters today so we've got one two and three so we've got nine packs there and then i've also got an art set that i bought in the shops earlier so we've got 13 packs to get through everybody shall we get into it i think we should Okie dokie, well, here we go everyone, we've got number one here, does this have the swell in it? Uh, is it this one that had the swell? I didn't really check the others, I kind of caught a glimpse of a swell on one. Uh, it doesn't look like this one has a swell, which, but that's fine because it has two Darunodon packs, so that's not a problem at all. Uh, does this one have a swell? Do you know what, it's really hard to tell on the camera, sometimes you have to sit at such funny light, uh, angles to find it. Um, there's some action around his mouth, but... We're not too worried about that. Um, Sonic, do you know what? Let's just get into it. I can't wait anymore. I just want to do it. I just want to rip in and see how we get on. So we've got nine packs from the blister packs. And then I've got, as I said, four extras that I bought from a really weird independent toy store uh, called Toy Barn House, which is kind of not too far away from me. It's like in one of my local cities. Cities? Local towns, sorry. Um, I live outside of London now. I grew up in London, but I've moved probably... I uh, don't even know how far I've moved away. Maybe... 30 miles? Not actually, no, that's a joke. Uh, what, 20 miles away from where I used to live? Um, so I'm out in Surrey now. And, uh, 
yeah, I get some random weird shops near me that I'm not really used to. So I kind of, I guess I kind of consider it similar to like a Smith's toy store or a Toys R Us, but much, much smaller. Uh, but anyway, let's get into the best of packs from the Pokemon Center UK. And let's see what the Pokemon Center UK's hit rates are like. Here we go, kids. This is very exciting. This is the first order I've ever done with the Pokemon Center. Uh, I wanted to do one from the US um, and have my brother-in-law bring the products over for Christmas, but I just couldn't bring myself to do it in the end. I don't know why. I think it's just because there was so much celebrations action going on and Evolving Skies was sold out and the US Pokemon Center just sells out so fast. Oh, I don't need you. And I don't need you either, but it does count as a hit. So we get a holo in the first pack. Hopefully that doesn't use up our luck for this triple blister we'll see we'll see um but yeah so i held off on getting anything from the pokemon center us and just thought do you know what they'll open one in the uk one day and lo and behold they did it really 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 quickly after i decided not to buy it in the us so it paid off and i can't believe the the amount of stock that is still well there's, there's still stock that's the point there's still stock that's what i can't believe don't know how much they've got but there is still stock on the site so if you haven't already Go and check out the website, there's tons of plushies, there's tons of cards, there's tons of everything. They've got some really cool Christmas clothes on there as well, um, which obviously you can just save for next Christmas. Anything behind? No. Um, but yeah, no, it's a cool cool site, a uh, really cool site, so check it out. But obviously, only commit if we get something good today. Because naturally, you're not going to want to chuck money at a product that doesn't have anything good, would you? No, no, no. So this is the last pack. Oh, look at the damage to this boy. Let's have a look. It's a Braviary. We don't care for you. We don't care for you. That's fine. Um, so it's three to the front now. That's right. Do we get a good hit in the first triple blister or are we going to be rocking just the Dialga Hollow and saying that that was worth the money? Because I don't think it is. One thing to consider when you're buying from the Pokemon Center. Oh, I've got this. But one of the things to consider is there is a flat rate for delivery, which is five pounds. So if you even if you're buying like 10 pounds worth of, of product, it's still a fiver. Or if you spend 500 pounds or a thousand pounds, it's still a five pound delivery charge. So do bear that in mind when you're ordering from the store anything in the last pack no so all we got from that was a dialga hollow from the first one not ideal that's not ideal i will not lie to you but we're gonna see if we have any luck in the second pack well we're gonna see if we get any luck in the third one as well aren't we but you can't go to the three without number two i don't make the rules up people i don't make the rules uh so i think we get the same coin yeah we've got the same coin in all of them which is quite nice uh, and I will be adding the Umbreons to my binder after this. Uh, so two Rays and a Sylveon. Let's start with Sylveon. It feels like a very thick pack. I doubt it will be an error pack, but hey, you never know. My last video, when we opened some with uh, the single blister pack, I had two reverse hollows and a non-hollow rare. So two reverse hollows was nice. I needed neither of them, so that did suck, but hey-ho. That's just the way it goes. One, two, three, four, five six seven eight nine i'm just counting because it feels like a bigger pack i think i need this and oh you okay no it wasn't a bigger pack but i think i need the petalil i think i need the petalil reverse i don't know this is such a big set it's so hard to keep up on i use the pokelector app Pokey Lecter, that's how it's pronounced, I suppose. It's written that, that's exactly that way. Um, just to keep up to date on what I do and don't have, so I can discuss or show people when I'm out and about and don't have my binder on me. Um, so I, I can't check that right now, because I'm using my bloody phone to record, on I? So I can't actually tell if I need it, but I will be checking after this, naturally. I'm hoping there's something else that I can add to the binder. I think at the moment, there's nothing new, definitely nothing new yet. I would like something fancy, especially after the alt art we pulled last video. If you haven't seen that, go and check that out. I'll link it now. I needed this, so that is good. And yo, Neuven V, I needed this. So this blister, well, this pack especially, has been delicious. Thank you, Mr. Rayquaza, for giving us some heat. Lovely stuff. Two nice hits. So that can go over in front of the Ray Ray. Lovely bits. Decent. Decent. I was wondering if we were going to get any V's or V Maxes, or if it was just going to be a very, very quiet day in the Guinness Sausage household for, for cards. But we have at least hit something, so that is always good. Oh God, I am butchering this pack. Apologies. 
I didn't see anything, mainly because I've got a huge ring light in my face and I'm trying to re uh, see what I'm doing through my phone. Oh, we've definitely got a V or better. I saw black borders. I think it's just a V. It'd be nice if it was something more. But let's see what we get on with. Come on, everybody. Give me a like. Help me out. I don't need you. What do we have here? Drake's on V. I needed this too. It's going with my VMAX. And uh, do you know what? I actually love this artwork. Not a massive fan of the Pokemon itself. Um, when it was when it was introduced in the Sword and Shield game, um, the fossil thing was just a bit weird for me. But I love how anime this looks. Like I don't I don't know how to describe it more than it looks like it's fresh out of an anime. So for me, that's a really cool design. I like it a lot. So that's banging. That booster box was delicious. Booster box. Jesus, Guinea. It is. It's late on a. What are we? Saturday? Saturday night? Yeah, Saturday night. Saturday night. That just goes to show you, I don't even know where I am anymore. All I know is it's the 8th of January. Um, but when you're watching this, it'll probably be the, I don't know, 20th or 30th. Or, oh, I don't even know anymore. All I know is I've got loads of videos backed up to upload at some point soon. And I haven't been... Oh, I'm still behind because of the Christmas break. So I've got a lot to do to catch up on. I'm sorry, guys. Right, we're going to do the Duralodons last and we'll do Umbreon first. Can we beat two Vs? Can we get a VMAX? Can we get an Altar? Can we get a Full Art Trainer? Can we get something delightful? Let's hope so. Really, really, I mean, the first blister was pretty poor. We got just the one hollow. So getting two Vs in that blister definitely saved the day. Let's hope this is another good blister and let's hope that the order isn't one good, one bad, one good, one bad, because that means I should have bought four. But yeah, let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh, I needed him. That's the last of the birds that I needed in reverse format so that's perfect and nope Smeargle again don't need you I mean just from adding these th at least three cards to the binder today will take me to 64% I know that much so that's good um, but 64% completion rate on what is a ginormous set what is it is it 237 cards or something like that oh no it's 269 with the master set um, for the master set I should say sorry um, and I don't know where I am currently. <laughs> this is a green pack, I, although, uh, to be fair, I, when I was opening these the first time they were around, they could have been anything. I was getting green code cards and getting VMAXs, I was getting white code cards with nothing in, so, yeah, no, do you know what? Not even going to worry, I was just give it, trying to give myself a little bit of a boost, hoping there was something good there, but it wasn't, and it's fine. Last Arulodon, come on, my brother, help me out. This is the last of the triple blisters from the Pokemon Center, and then we've got four packs from Toy Barn House to get into as well. But so far, I mean, I've got three new cards, so that's good. Four new cards now, I think it is, maybe, 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 I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, just excited to be able to get some product from the Pokemon Center UK, which is really exciting. Um, have you guys bought anything from there yet? Are you planning on if you haven't already? Uh, let me know what you're thinking about doing this. I know there's a ton of Fusion Strike product on there at the moment. It's a set that I'm not super excited about, so I haven't bought any. Well, that's a lie. I bought three packs just uh, for me and my brother-in-law to open at the, par uh, at the pub. And he pulled a Chandelier VMAX, but yeah, I'm not worried about anything else. This is a good one. I needed this. So this is paid off for sure. And anything in the final slot, come on. Do you know what? I'm not even mad because it's, I have opened, I don't even know, maybe Maybe, what? Well, hold on, I've done at least a booster box. So I've done maybe 60 packs, and this is the first Thievil I've pulled, right? I can't believe that, so I'm not even upset. It wasn't the best blister pack, but I'm still happy with it. I won't lie, I'm still happy with it. Right, so now we've come to the conclusion that the Pokemon sent, uh, packs are alright, I suppose. Shall we do Toy Barn House and see what they had? They had, so this is just basically uh, a booster box that they rip packs out and put on display. So no idea what order they were in or, I mean, that, that never really makes a difference. But sometimes, you know, you, you have your lucky side that you like to pull from or you like to pull from the back or the front of the booster box or you like to um, just go random and pick four cards from all the four packs from all over the place. I did not get that opportunity, unfortunately. So. We'll see how we get on. I think we've got a V, or, or maybe better. I'm not too sure. I saw something, some sort of colouring. Let's hope it's something brand spanking new and shiny. Come on, Guinea. What we got? What we got? Oh, it's another good one I needed. And... <gasps> Yo! Oh, my days! 
Yes! This is my first full art Pokemon that isn't a, a, an alt art or a VMAX or whatever. Yes! Dragonite V from a loose pack, believe it or not, from a loose pack. <sighs> Looks really good condition as well. I mean, the centering is not incredible, but it's actually, no, it's actually pretty good. It's actually pretty good. Wow, look at the colours on that. Do you know what's really weird is I was dreaming today of getting this card, and I have. So, I don't even know what to do. This is like the time, this is like when I got the alt art in the last video. Um, and I'm kind of like speechless, but really excited at the same time. <laughs> so, you are getting instant sleeve. Wow, that's my first full art Pokemon like that, which I'm so pleased about. Oh, naturally I've got the Espeon, the Glaceon, the Leafeon, etc. But that's, that's a beauty. It's an absolute beauty, guys. Look at him, Mr. Dragonite, just hanging out. Oh, what pack was that from? That was from, oh, wait, hold on. It was from the Darunadon pack. Once again, Darunadon doing absolute bits. I told you, I swear to God, Darunadon is the one, man. That has proved it again. Proved it again. You, put, you go to, if you can see a booster box, or you just see random packs, just make sure you grab at least one Darunadon because they are good. I swear to you, they are good. Look at that. Very, very pleased. That's that's made my video. I'm not going to lie. That has made my video. I wanted a full art so badly today. And I've pulled the one that I wanted the most. So very happy Guinea Sausage over here. Very happy and diddy. Right. Do we, do we think we can add anything else to the binder today? Oh, well, we just have. Because I don't even have the normal slack off. But we've got the reverse, which is even better. And... We don't care for you, but yes, Binder is going to have a lovely time this evening, I swear. I mean, the bulk, not so much, but the Binder will definitely have a lot of action this evening. Don't you worry about that, everybody. This is the beautiful thing when you get to open, how many packs was it? 13, I think it is again. 13 packs, you're guaranteed something new, right? Well, you're not guaranteed it, but when the set's this big, you kind of got to expect you're going to get something, right, that you don't have before. And I've been very lucky with the reverse hollows. I swear, tell you what, when I open my booster box, my, my second booster box that I have behind me on, on my shelving at the moment, I'm going to pull a lot of duplicates when it comes to the reverse rares because I'm doing pretty well on them at the moment. So get at me if you want to trade. Hit me up with a message. We just pulled this earlier, which is mad because I've needed this for a while. And Victini, I have you, but that's cool. Not a problem at all, mate. That's fine. I'm not upset. It's still a hit, so... Uh, what is it? Two out of three of those packs were white code so far. And let's find out if the last one is a white code too. Um, but yeah, that, bo that, that booster box is going to be full of duplicates, I reckon. So if you're needing reverse rares for Evolving Skies, let me know in the comments and we can organise some trades because I'd absolutely love to trade with you guys. I would love to. At the moment, I'm finding it really difficult to. I've only got a couple of mates that are collecting Evolving Skies. Uh, a lot of them are still kind of going through Chilling Rain and Shining Fates and Hidden Fates. So, um, yeah, I would love to trade with anyone that wants to trade. So hit me up. Last pack of the night, guys, of the video even. It's the night for me. But do we get anything we need? Not sure if we do or not. Last pack. Here we go. It's okay, though. It's fine. It's fine. It's totally fine. Because, everybody... We got Dragonite V for that, which looks so sick. <laughs> Very pleased with that. We got Drake Assault V, and we got the Neuvern V, which were both from the same blister pack, triple blister pack, I should say. <laughs> if I can get my words out. And then we had the Dialga. Oh, and Side what are you doing there, mate? So yeah, we did pretty well. I mean, I cannot complain. I think money-wise, money well spent. I mean, it's always fun to open packs, and that's why I do this. But to get some decent hits like this, very, very happy indeed. Guys, thank you so much for watching. As I've said, once we get to 100 likes, I will be opening the Elite Trainer Box from the Pokemon Center for Evolving Skies on video. I will also doing some giveaways when we get to 50 subs, and I will be releasing a video for that soon to let you know what will be up for giveaways. But thanks very much for watching. I love you all very much. Guinea Sausage out!